Hello everyone, it's now the 14th of summer and it's Rudolph's birthday, so we're gonna go get him a gift. Well, give him a gift, but first we gotta figure out how's the weather for today. Back to you, Janet. Oh. Well then, that's unfortunate. I can't recall anything that's supposed to happen, but didn't want it to rain. Did not. Hmm. Hello. I don't blame you. Of course. Why is everyone so afraid of him? Alright, bring it in. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's cool. And that's it. You don't get to find out what else he meant. It's weird that she actually grew up with her. Like, literally, that's why Dia calls Martha Grandma. I mean, can you blame her? Anyway, other than the event, let's get to work. And since I'm gonna be selling this anyway, let's just give him one. Let's be best friends for life. For life. I should really start innocent life again, but I'm just too exhausted to do it. I'll, I'll pick it up one day and eventually, but today is not that day. I said that before. I know I did. <laughs> but we... I gotta remember to... Make sure all these guys are inside for the night. So they don't... You know. They don't get sick. Especially this youngin' right here. She is a deer. And then we have the horsey. Which the harvest gods is going to help us with caring for. I can't believe my name's a sheriff. But then again, there are lady sheriffs. It's a noble name. I believe in you, Sheriff. We shall win those races. Hello, Miss... Shake? I'm sorry, I'm used to calling it Brandy. It's like a tradition that always lasted me in Harvest Moon, and I didn't want to be mean in this Let's Play. Oh, well. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me milk you. There we go. That's a good one. No! <gasps> oh... I feel like a dummy. I, I don't even want to play anymore. <laughs> I'll admit, I don't. But I'm going to continue. I wasted some products. So that means I'm definitely going to have to work with for someone today. I might actually even let it be... Let it be Ronald. I haven't worked for him in forever. I haven't seen him in forever. I feel bad. I should really go to him more often. But I feel like such a tool. Oh... I had such a perfect streak with not messing up like that, and yet here I am, messing up. Oh well, there's nothing I can do about it. There's no point in crying over spilt milk. A hey, pause for effect. And there we go. I know it wasn't that funny, but it was funny to me. And that's all that matters. If it's funny to me, it's always funny to me. And take this one. Yeah, I'm not that even in other Harvest Moon games. I'm trigger happy with the X button, and sometimes I just let him fly. I don't mean to. But that's why I like in like, um, which one was it? Uh, I swear there was a Harvest Moon game that if you put down something, magical melody. I'm glad that in magical melody, it's like, okay, I'm just gonna take a while for us to appear. Pick me up. Pick me up. Pick me up. And if, you know, you, you had a choice. And I like that in um, A New Beginning and Story of Seasons that you don't really have to worry about it too much. They just, they stay there for a while, though I think they diminish in, um, uh, in quality. I think it happens in Tale of Two Towns and Grand Bazaar for that matter. But nope, most of the games are just, you throw it, it's gone. I mean, it's not too early, I can just reset the game, but I'm not gonna do that. We all have our faults, and I have one. I have one. Sometimes I like to throw milk. Beautiful. You know what? 
At least it wasn't golden, though. I'm gonna look at that as my, you know, the silver lining. It wasn't. It was not golden, though. Bless it. Um, I don't think I need to fill it up. We're gonna do it. And actually, before we even go looking for Gwen, since she's gonna be there on the way, we're gonna go sell this alfalfa because we don't need it. I sure so. I mean, I don't know how to give it to my horse. I'm pretty sure I would just pick it up and hand it to him. Her. Oh, my goodness. I'm gonna have like. I'm gonna be confused about that forever. Hello, Miss Lila. I'm not here to give you a gift, unfortunately. Well, unfortunately for you. I just. I like you. But I love another. She's amazing and wonderful. And I would chill a bit before going to Lewis to sell the scrap metal. But. Gwen first. She's more important. She is my world. My world. And there we go. And we turn. And we turn again. She should be here by now. Then again, I'm not entirely sure when she makes her appearance. There she is. Usually sometimes she's actually in the barn. Which is pretty cool. I thought that was a nice little touch. Yes, I am making sure. Yes, he does. Alright, but I'm the same age as you. You should at least admire me. I'm doing the same thing. He just has more horses. You're great. But fine, be that way. Let's see if he gives you a horse-drawn carriage or something like that. I mean, I can give that to you either, but... I'm just saying... All that glitters is not golden. Wait, I'm not sure that's how the saying even goes. What am I saying? What am I saying? Whatever. To work! Hello? Perk. Am I giving you anything? Can I actually have stuff to sell? My rucksack is only... It's after 10! Let's go get rid- Ooh! And now there's very berries. So we're gonna grab these first. And then we're gonna go to Lewis and sell some of our scrap metal. So goodness, he uses it. What's he use it for? Don't know! I think I showed the inside of his house. I'm pretty sure it's not pretty. It's not. It's really not. But, you know. He's a single man who has a crush on Lila. What can we expect from him? Not much, I say. Not much. There we go. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Let's see here. I think I cracked my neck. Oh, no. We could... But no. I'm not here for that. I am here to sell. Taylor. Is that a lot? Nope. Does, do I care? Nope. Let's see the delivery request. Oh, I can do almost all of it. Oh, I can definitely do this one. Sure! Sure! You get money from it. I probably can do that one too, but wait, what does it do? Sure, let's go for it. That'll be fun. That'll be a nice, fun little tidbit thing to do. However, I should remember to take care of those crystals and stuff. I mean, I, we have it all, but, you know, I don't think it's really required to do all his requests for whatever event Pep he has. If it does, then I am screwed, because I did none of his during spring. It was too early. I couldn't do anything. They, have, they can't blame me for that one. Like, do they really expect me to be able to do anything? Then again, compared to... Compared to Woody, I could always... No matter what, go mining, so I guess there's no excuse for that one. I'm just saying, it's not necessary. Not at all. Hm. Huff. Yeah, it's probably awake. Let's go do some good deal while we're here. Huh. Uh, what? I don't recall her being downstairs around this time, but... I guess I'm mistaken. She's starting her lessons early. What a good girl. She's really sweet though, guys. I mean, so many people love her and there's many good reasons why. Hello again. Good morning indeed. And I am envious of you. Wait a minute. I do have a lot to do. I'm giving gifts. I'm earning money. I'm collecting items. Yes, it is real. I wouldn't give you a fake fruit. 
Or would I? <laughs> One day I'll get an evil laugh down. Hello, Miss Maka. I haven't. I saw Juno today, actually. I was gonna say I did it, but I did. Oh, no, 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 no. All of them. Yep, all of them. Take it all from me. Um. Only because I want to give some to others. I only have one full moon berry left. Gina, not Gina. <laughs> Gwen, you're killing me. Yes, let's work some more. Yes, I do. Oh, yes. At least we know how to do that, everyone. So that's a good thing. I mean, I would speed it up, but then I don't know how to properly make funny music and not have my voice in it. Maybe next time. Maybe next time I'll actually fail a dish. Just to be funny. Mwah, mwah, mwah. But no, I won't. Because milk is precious and I need it. I need it to make all these cheeses. And to give to the doggy so he may like me. No, I should have done it today. I fell it to the horse. But uh Spilled milk. Not let, not get a cry over about it. Over it. Oh, the cheese belongs to us. That was stupid. I'm so sorry. I can't edit that out, but I apologize for that joke. Yes! Give us cheesy. I don't know, I'm preparing a mozzarella. Mozzarella. And yes, we are finished. Hmm. You know, I don't think that's what the large milk is actually is the cost of, but I'm not gonna beat around the bush. What's up? Hmm, see? She's so sweet. I know she said something sweet about Kurt too, and that's adorable. Anyway, onwards. We have many people to see today. And it's wrong it's Ronald's. It's Royal's birthday, we're gonna give him a gift. I don't care what anyone says. But he's trying to destroy the valley. Yes, I understand that. But he's actually a really nice guy. A really, really nice guy. I think. Oh, he hasn't given any, any reason to say otherwise. Oh well. Onwards! Mm hmm, who is behind me? Nope, don't need you. Mm -hmm. It's a butterfly! And while we're here, since we gotta look for beetles anyway, I really don't know what certain tree they come out. I really don't hunt for beetles and stuff. But bam! Ooh, tell me this is it. I'd cry, I'd cry from joy. Uh, no! Ugh, whatever. Wait, did they say it could be a present? Huh. But I know someone who would like it. Now I can give him all the bugs I want and get paid for it. I mean, I still don't think I should be taking this kid's money, but he offers it. What can I do? When he offers you the money, you just take it. Alright, so we're not going to go mining, but we are going to give Rudolph a present. He deserves it. Right, Rudolph? I have made jokes about him being the red-nosed reindeer, but that's just me. Uh -huh. I know he likes eggs. We shall give him a name. Well, I don't expect you to hatch it, but I do hope you enjoy eating it. I mean, if you want to hatch it, cool, but... I don't think your boss would be alright with you catching a chicken. She might actually dislike it. Then again, where are they getting the food from? Do you think Funland Headquarters actually sends them food every day or something? Or every month? Or do they actually go to the store in like the skies and get the food? It'd be funny. Bum 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 yeah, blah blah blah, don't come too late. Yeah, I get it. I don't care. Is there very berries over there? Nope. Then I'm pouring them. Goodness, this is tiring. I kinda wish I had a controller now. 
<gasps> it's a full moon berry. I don't wait, Parsley. I need the berry. Don't you dare touch it. I don't think they can, but I like the idea of them trying. It's mine. <laughs> Bang. What is that? That's a caterpillar. Good, this is not what I'm looking for. Alright, one more time. Maybe we'll get something cool. Maybe a fruit. Nope, there's probably another drone deal. I regret it. I regret picking up that request, but oh well. He bribed me. But money. And I like money. Who doesn't like money? I hurt my elbow. Alright. Hello, my friend. Hello. I have something for you. Yep, I'm gonna. How many of these do I have? Eh, not worth it. And she likes full moon berries too. I don't want to give her them. I'll just give her an egg. There you go. I'm glad you wanted it. Now we're gonna sell. Keep one for the doggy. He deserves it. He's stayed with me for so long. Let's see what delivery will cost you for that. Oh. Yeah, um. No, I'm not probably not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make that one, not gonna make that one. Definitely not gonna make any of that. Definitely not. Okay, they weren't, weren't important anyway. No, Katie is important, but her requests aren't that important. I don't think so. Um. <laughs> I can't think of anything else to do. I mean, we can look for Ariella. We can do the. Which, by the way, Ariella likes slumber. I think because she can fix things in the church, which I'll probably go find some for her, actually. Let's go find some- well, I can't find lumber for her, but I can go get it. I just don't want- do I have any more eggs? No, I don't. I don't like giving her all my lumber. I mean, I can easily make it back, but it still doesn't matter the fact that, like, n no, you don't- you don't need my lumber. You do not. You can say you do, but you don't. So, we'll just give her a piece of lumber anyway. I mean, just one piece. If she becomes a purple heart, that's fine. That's actually great. I hardly ever talk to her, which is upsetting. I mean, she's a great character. If I was to go upstairs to her room, you would see how great she is. Oh my goodness, there's so little. This is what in here. We might as well figure out what's the other stuff that Lewis needed. Ten, two, and three. I don't remember that. 10, 2, 3, oh no, wait, okay, hold on. <laughs> We're just gonna have to do this one at a time. Alright, 10. Nope. I'm gonna put three, I'm gonna do three of each. Just to be safe. But then again, I'm not entirely sure that's what he wanted. Um, iron and copper. Yep. So no matter what, I'll just put it in action now. Um, one more time. Oh no! There we go. Alright, so I'm putting back an iron. Okay, that's not that bad. And we'll get money for it! And look how, how much closer we are to the goal again, even though I wasted, what, a lot of money? So that's not- oh no! Ugh, son of a- Alright, so this video is just going to be all of my mistakes. That's fun. Now I'm going to make sure I have two. Now I have two. And we're going to go give them to Lewis before he closes. And then we're going to find... Uh, what's her name? Ariella. Because she is... Somewhere. I want to say she doesn't do anything afterwards, but I could be wrong. She travels around the valley just as much as... Chester does, but all she does is travel around. And because I actually have a lot of bugs, I'm just going to give him one. Because I really don't want all these bugs. Next time I'm just going to hit and quit. <laughs> right, give me money. Yep, yep, give it to me. Give me money. I did say it was. I felt weirded by it, but that didn't stop me. I need money, guys. What can I do? We need the money. Okay, let's deliver some requests. Yep. Deliver. Deliver. 
Deliver. Let's go take some time. See, look, now we got the gold. We have the gold money. Oh well. I'm the only one energetic about it, and that's fine. It's good to be energetic. Even if you're alone. <laughs> anyway, that's over with. Onwards, to continue. And look for Ariella, wherever she may be. She could be anywhere, technically, but just gonna keep looking. Where else can she be? Worst comes to worst, she's probably at the church, and since Tuesday, Joe is fishing. So most likely she's at the church grounds. I mean, that's what I remember from all the times playing it, and just seeing her there, mentioning how there's a guy who fishes there, but he hardly ever catches anything. Hint, hint, it's Joe. Oh, hey! Look at that! I was wrong! But on the right side, we found her. Oh my god, if I drop that. See, hey, here we go. She takes us to church. Um, since I talked about fishing, let's go do that. Oh, the animals. Mm, let's go here, the animals and just call it a day then. We'll fish tomorrow. Since it's raining, some fish, are, some fish apparently come out. Who knew? But I don't think... Uh, what's the same? That's actually the wrong thing. But I don't think Papa comes out. I mean, I think he does, but I could be very, very wrong. I'm usually wrong in these kind of scenarios. Anywho. Now, once we take care of all that, I'm just going to call it a night with this episode. There's not much more we... Well, we can do more, but since getting sick that first time and, you know, fixing it so I didn't have to get sick, I really don't want to risk that because I worked hard where I'm at. A lot of work came into this. And you know, you guys have seen it. We came from all the way from like the 8th all the way to the 14th and soon to be 15th. We'll put this down here. So I really don't want to get sick and ruin all this hard work. I mean, if I'm going to get sick in the game, I at least want to get sick when it's two sunny days in a row. However, there's a risk that, you know, I get sick one day, and then it's raining the next, and then my animals get sick, and then Gwen's gonna beat me up, and so is Bob, and I don't want that. I don't. And I don't want to keep running back and forth for animal medicine. I did that once with Save the Homeland, and all my chickens were sick for some reason. I don't remember why my chickens were sick. I think I just messed up and forgot to feed them. So I was going back and forth on my horse, just running, 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 trying to get it done. And save all my chickens. I made it. But not without consequences. I was scared for the rest of my life. My re the rest of my farming life in Korea. He's got a fancy mohawk. Alright. Excuse you, Robin. I don't understand why you're yawning. You're not. You sleep all day. Goodness. Okay, spell it. In you go, everybody. Tomorrow's gonna rain. You guys don't need to be out for it. In you go. There we go, pony. And everyone's inside. And we don't have to worry about the dog because of the dog cow, so that's a good it was a good purchase. Ooh, sorry, my knuckles. But that's it for this episode, guys. There were some birthdays, there was an event. We learned that Chester's a creepy person. But then again, we knew that the minute we saw him. I mean, it's not that he's it's not because he's super religious, it's just because I don't know, he look he does look creepy, guys. Like, there's no need for him to look that creepy. Anyway, that's it. I hope you guys will join in the next episode. So, see you next time.